50 is fabulous. It is an age that deserves special and respectful attention. Reaching the age of 50 is a special milestone, therefore should be celebrated. It was a beautiful occasion to wine and dine with a fashionable Dunio Lun lawyer, the Abuja-based jeweler and socialite, as she pampered herself to a ravishing party to mark her 50th birthday anniversary. The event, which was held on Friday, 19th May 2017, at the Lekki Coliseum, Lagos, witnessed a huge turnout of family, friends and business associates home and abroad to celebrate her at the remarkable age of 50. Those in attendance, Senator Joy Emode and Duni's younger sister, Honorable Folake Oshinowo Oluloyo, the beautiful wife of Dr. Barista Tunde Oshinowo, Teddy Shine, the famous Lagos socialite who threw his weight gallantly behind the coverage of the event by BOS. Others include Iabo Ojo, among others. Duni Ulun Lawyer is one of the few exotic jewelry merchants in the Federal Capital Territory, who is patronized by the cream de la cream in the society, or the high and mighty as they say. Educated in England in the 80s, Mrs. Duni Ulun Lawyer returned to Nigeria in the 90s and decided to venture into the jewelry business. She started selling from the house, but later got a shop at Alade Market in Lagos. The flair to go into business instead of seeking a white-collar job or becoming a politician like some members of her family is obviously a trait she inherited from her mother, who was a jeweler. Dunio Lunloyo had seen her mother trading in jewelry and had always longed to be part of the business. Young Dunio Lunloyo, daughter of one-time governor of Oyo State, Dr. Omolulu Lunloyo, as a secondary school student, Took some of her mother's took some of her mother's merchandise to school, which she sold to her teachers and made profit, a practice she did with pleasure. So, it did not come as a surprise to many when she became a jewelry merchant and floated her jewelry shop, Dunloy Gems, situated inside the Nikon Luxury Hotel, Abuja. She is one of the few women in Nigeria who sells and displays diamonds in their stores. To many celebrities in Abuja and its environs, the name Dunio Lunloyo means diamonds and other precious stones. The celebration began with an opening prayer by Pastor Lushola, a friend of the celebrant. This was followed by tributes from friends and family of the Lady of the Day, Mrs. Dunio Lunloyo, as they expressed heartfelt wishes to the celebrant. Mr. Dun, we are so glad that you are here tonight and your mom is alive to witness this and we are all here to bless you tonight Duni you will move from glory to glory from honor to honor in the mighty name of Jesus the Lord will favor you always all the days of your life you will be happy hallelujah Senator Joy Emode in her remark described the celebrant as a hard-working reliable and dependable woman who gives her heart to all which is a glaring reason why there is a massive turnout of people at the event to felicitate with her she heartily welcomed everyone to the occasion and urged them to have a good time the need is an energy the need is one of the most reliable person we've ever seen a very hard working Maybe if she's your friend, so do you? We thank God for today. 50 years, not 50 days. Like I said earlier, not a day for long six. We are here to enjoy with her. And I thank God that we have more than enough to eat and drink. 
and danced and met Mary and thank God for what he has done for her and for all of us at least for being here together today. So I, on behalf of her, welcome everybody to this hall and may God bless all of you. Thank you very much. Mrs. Adeola Bangba also described the celebrant as highly dependable, hardworking and firm, adding that she is selfless and would go out of her way to help others. She prayed God to continually bless her and surprise her with good tidings. Mrs. Adeola Akbangba, who could not contain her joy at this point, gave the celebrant a warm hug. She's very dependable. If Billy likes you, she likes you. If she doesn't like you, there's nothing you can do about it. And Duni can be, she can be hard, she can be cross, she can be firm, but Duni can give you her heart. Um, Duni, I want to say that knowing you means a lot to me. You are a very good friend. You are a dependable friend. You are a reliable friend. Alhaji Jamil Obatonyibo, in his words, described the celebrant as a go-getter and an entrepreneur par excellence who is flourishing in her trade. She is a woman that makes different things to different people. She she is extraordinarily uh, kind. She is an entrepreneur for excellence. And she is truly on top of her trade. Even on telephone, you can easily test you whether you are holding a dollar, holding a pound sign, or it is a dollar, or it's a uh, Saudi real. I don't know how she does it. But she understands these currencies even more than the Naira. The celebrant, Mr. Fulu Ogutade, said Duni's primary trait is her extreme outspokenness, adding that she's a Puritan. Honey. Uh, Duni, on behalf of all, all your cousins, we want to wish you a very happy 50th birthday. We pray that you will live for many, many more years in good health, and that all that you lay your hands upon will prosper exceedingly. Uh, Duni is my very dear Aburu, I'm very glad to say. Uh, I understand that she's very, very generous. Well, I haven't experienced that generosity yet, but I'm sure I will do so in due course. Duni, once again, congratulations and many, many, many happy returns. Thank you. Fresh dance. Elated friends joined her on the dance floor as she grooved to the serenading performance by Ray Amodi, the UK trained son of Senator Joy Amodi. After which the dance floor was declared open as guests boogied in twos, gorgeously dressed in her second outing like a new bride.
her way to the cake stand. The cutting of the cake was supervised by one of her friends. Give me a resounding oh! and a sensational and, and a vibrating and, and let people say to me. The duo engaged the celebrant in songs of thanksgiving and appreciation to God for his goodness upon her life. This was quickly followed by a photo session with her children, grandchildren and friends. The event's compare supervised the toast as guests clinked glasses in merriment. The event rounded off with a vote of thanks. Mrs. Duni Ululoyo appreciated everyone for gracing the occasion and prayed God to grant the mercy journey to their destinations. Afterwards, it was dance and merriment all the way. Producers of the BC Olati Law Show and owners of Biscon TV, we heartily congratulate the very pretty and industrious Mrs. Duni Olun Loyo on the occasion of her Golden Jubilee.